What much excitement? Oh no, the train, we've missed the train. We've missed the first steam train, so we're gonna have to come back and get the next one. It's a disaster here at Spence. We've missed the train, I think. Hang on, we might be able to get it, you never know. Oh no, the train's away, we've missed it. It's a disaster, the train's away. We've missed the train, bro. It's a disaster. There it goes into the distance. We're gonna to have to wait for the next one, which is at 12.55, do you think, bro? Yeah. 12.55. Well, here's the, uh, the old platform with some of the original advertising placards still there. Look at that, excellent. So we're just talking to the, uh, the man at the moment. There he is. Both. Excellent. So, could you tell that story about the ghost just one more time, do you think? Why? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> You're going to do that thing, you know. <laughs> just just uh, very briefly. Uh, well, sometimes uh, you'll hear footsteps coming up the ramp. Ooh. Two or three footsteps coming up the ramp, and then they stop. And where they stop, in the, going by the old plans, there was a porter's toilet. Excellent. Oh, spooky stuff. Thank you very much for that, sir. Excellent. Well, troops, did you enjoy that man's talk? <laughs> yeah, it's quite interesting. That was all right. Roger, get in the camera. Yeah. We need to see more of you. <laughs> we need to see more yeah. of you in the camera. The Spiz member number three, Rose Marie, is here today. <laughs> She's here. Yeah. She's available today. She's here. Yes. So, we're going for a walk. She's actually legal today. <laughs> <laughs> we're going for a stroll along the platform here. Um, we can't unfortunately get onto the other side where the interesting stuff is, but you never know. <laughs> we might just go for a wee sneaky one. Probably not. Anyway, so we've got, a, we've got a little while to wait for the next train. It's called a Ruston. It's called a Ruston, whoever that is. A lovely little engine. Kind of like Thomas the Tank. Oh sure, take another good photograph. Right, well there's some old carriages, that's Johnny Walker over there. And there's BP. And there's just some old equipment over there. Excellent. Oh honestly, somebody's got a, a saw. Right, so you see the trees just uh, there? Yes, we see them yeah, both. You see those trees there? We are aware, <laughs> aware of them. them. Now, they were actually planted back in the 1930s, hundreds, the early 1900s, because when the Royal Train used to stop here, Queen Victoria didn't want anybody to see her having a lunch and going to the toilet. Oh. So therefore, they were planted those trees. She would stop here where that train was. Yes, that's right. Have a lunch, go to the toilet, and nobody from the public could actually see her. Excellent. So that's stuff. the Queen Victoria Royal Trees. Thank you very much, bro. You're welcome. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you, everybody, one and all. <laughs> we are not amused. Now, Rosemary, what are your expectations <laughs> of this train ride? What are you expecting from it? Is it going to go choo-choo or puff-puff? How's it going to go? I think it's going to go. I think it's going to start choo-choo, then it's going to go. <laughs> <laughs> bro, what do you think? <laughs> I think I'll go... <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Okay, thank you, people. Right, well, we're sitting waiting on the 1255 train leaving Bridgerton, going to Brecon. So it's going to be quite exciting. Thank you. The bold and find the kitchen. Well, we have an update on Bro's <laughs> laminate leg. Look at the state of that bruise. My God, I that's no, terrific. I didn't no. actually know. Dear, dear. Well, wow, here's the train. Right, we're live with Spiz Cam. Go in. on the steam train. Going to be leaving very shortly from Bridge of Dun and we'll be going to Brecon. A 
I feel like Ma Michael Partillo. What is, it, what is his name? Michael Partillo. Let me see what my Bradshaw says about this place. Yes, yeah, Bridge of Darden in the old days was used by Queen Victoria. Oh, here's Rosemary. Talking about Queen Victoria. Here she is. Thank you very much. Are you the driver? Yes. <laughs> oh God, we're, we're doomed. Well, there's much excitement here. The train is moving. Here we are. Oh. There we are, look. Hey, we're off. Thanks for my hat doesn't come off. first class area so I have obviously just separated myself from Ro and Rosie who are in the working class area. These had their own uh, partition doors, sliding doors and uh, lamps and all sorts of things here so you can have your own little private carriage as you sat here and watch the world go by. It's actually really really, uh, it's a bit jerky this ride. <laughs> I'm sure that's to do with it just being a really old thing, but you know what, it's just been a, a nice, gentle little, something different for Spitz to do. <laughs> my god, what a ride, imagine having to go from, like from Edinburgh to London on this thing, my god, it would take you forever. Anyway, excellent fun. <laughs> Back in the uh, the pleb area, where well, as you can see there are two plebs. There's one, and the other one's over there. There you go. Back right along. We're at the end of the line, folks. Journey there, Rosemary? Yes, it was lovely. Very good. Excellent. We have arrived, bro. A rebate. Oh, oh, excellent. Let's get off then. Oh, there we are. There's the steam train that we were on. There we go. Look at that. Excellent. So we've got 10 minutes to hang around Brecon now, so... Any shops, Rosie, for you? <laughs> I'm changing the points. Always telling... I'm going to go into the shop and I'm going to go and buy Brian and Karen 
a souvenir. Well, I'm going to stand on these scales and see how much I weigh. So there I am. 160, just under 160. Right, here's Bro. Oh, Bro doesn't go around as far as you. Uh, good Lord, man. I'm 16, go, I'm 16 stone. It doesn't go enough round for Bro. Bro's broken the scales. I went up to 160. Yeah. Dear, oh dear, Bro's broken the scales. Hang on. Well, Bro's is getting chatted up by the train driver. What's going on? Disaster. Right, you have the extreme close-up of the mechanisms that work this thing. Wow. Pistons and levers and pulleys and all sorts. Wow. Gauges. Excellent. Seven. Seven. Fairly poor. Okay, thank you.